what's up you guys? It's Ella Ladd from Kids First Film Critics and I am currently at the Regency Theater in Los Angeles, California on the red carpet of the Daddy's Home 2 premiere. As a fan of the original Daddy's Home, I was so psyched to be able to see the second film. Hi guys, so I'm here with Will Ferrell and we're discussing the film that he starred in and produced, Daddy's Home 2. Uh, how are you doing? Uh, I'm doing well. How are you? I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> It's a beautiful so, day. It is. Yeah, well, it? Evening. well, afternoon. 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 Yeah. Um, so, what was the most fun scene to film? Well, this movie is so fun. There's a lot of physical set pieces in the movie. Uh, you know, the kids are great. I, I, there are a lot. I mean, we have a really funny, crazy scene that takes place in a manger where we mm -hmm. actually yeah. are all the characters in a living nativity scene, and it. It devolves into a snowball fight. Um, that was really funny. We have a massive high stakes argument over the thermostat setting in a house, uh, which is so ridiculous, but really funny. Uh, so there's there's a ton to choose from. And how much improvisation did you get to do in this film? You know, we we always kind of approach these movies the same way. We, we film the scene as written until we feel like we have it, and then we do three or four takes improvised and until uh, we've kind of exhausted that. And so, yeah, every for every scene, for every take, we improvise almost all the time. So, uh, you know, we don't necessarily always use it, but it, it gives you another chance to think of extra jokes. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. So, uh, what was the most fun part about filming? Um, probably being with all the actors and actresses because they're just so fun to be around. Yeah. And what would you say is the most challenging part? Um, keeping a straight face because I'm on I'm on my phone the whole movie and like the movie's so funny I just have to keep a straight face and it's so hard. <laughs> and you're in this movie. Hollywood, a lot of very big name celebrities in this film. Uh, how do you stay so humble? Wait, how do I stay so humble? Yes. Um, well, I just think of them as normal people because, like, I kind of met them over the first movie, and that was like when I was littler, so I didn't really know who they were, anyways. So I just don't really think of it just as normal people that I'm acting with. Thank you so much. Thank nice you. to meet you. Hello, I'm here with the legend, Mark Wahlberg. How are you doing today? Thank you. Did you call me a legend? Yes. Well, thank you. Wow, that made me feel really good. I appreciate that very much. Thank you. Okay, so uh, I'm going to ask you a few questions about the film. Is that okay? Uh, all right, so what was the most fun you had while filming? Every day was fun. It was like, you know, it's one of those things where you don't really consider it work. The only thing that makes it work is that I actually have to leave my family for an extended period of time. Time. Other than that, we're hanging out, we're making each other laugh all day, we're goofing around. It's not really that much work when you work on a movie like this. I do a lot of movies where it's very tough and strenuous work. This is a joy and a pleasure. So. That's great. And, uh, strain tolerance. Okay. Um, your character had a lot of restraint and tolerance towards his dad and to Brad. So, how do you, as an actor, how do you justify that? Like, how did that work out for you? You know, I just try to play the part uh, in a very truthful and real way. But, you know, we're all growing and evolving, and we all have issues and problems, and we don't, fig we don't have it figured out, just like I don't have it all figured out in raising my kids. But it's a learning process. We're trying to grow and learn together, and ultimately, even though we give each other a hard time, we come together in the end for the better of the kids. So. Thank you so Thanks. much. All right. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm good. Uh, how did you prepare for the role? You know, I was lucky enough to have the first one to have to prepare, and but the second, but the second time around, it was really fun because they gave Sarah her own anxieties, and she kind of was a little bit, she gets a little bit crazy about what other what other parents think about how she's parenting. So that was really fun. And Sean and I talked a lot on the phone, and we talked about you know before I came in to do the part, and we talked about the script and all kinds of things, and then we had a read through and. Everybody's so great. 
And going off what you said about like her anxieties about other parents, uh, what did you think about the conflict between the two women in the film? I liked that it wasn't about us. It wasn't about you know two women competing uh, based on looks or something very superficial. It was about two people trying to raise their daughters and one influence in the other and sort of the things you run into about two different parenting styles. And then also the idea that, you know, I think as a parent, now I'm a parent, you're, you're always worried that you're not doing everything right. You want to do everything so right. And the idea that you might be doing something wrong and someone might be writing that down as they watch you is <laughs> terrifying. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. What was the most fun you had on set? Uh, I think when people see the movie, they'll realize like the whole thing is fun. Specifically for me, I enjoyed the end, which I'm not going to spoil for you. But because it's just big and grand and it involves a lot of folks, and I, it was fun for me. All right, and what do you identify with most within your character? Is there anything quality well, and specific? They, they, you know, uh, Roger's pretty much a tough guy, and I've been known to be tough when called upon, so that was that was pretty easy to do. But you'll see, maybe or maybe not, he may have a softer side to him. All right. Hi, guys. It's Mario Selman. Make sure to go to Kids First on Facebook. Mwah. Love you guys. Hi, my name is Judy Costa, and make sure to like face Kids First on Facebook. Hey, thank you so much. Wow, that was so much fun. Anyways, see you guys next time. I'm Ella Ladd from Kids First Film Critics, signing out. Bye. Where's my dad? Dad, don't move. There's a pack of wolves on you. I kind of want to pet him, Dad. Don't make eye contact with the alpha wolf. I already did. Right in the eyes.